top executives from MGM Resorts International met with Springfield's Mayor Dominic Sarno about the rumored sale of the downtown casino. Yeah, it's got the community buzzing about what the future will hold for the state's third casino. And 22 News reporter Alana Flood spoke to the mayor today. Alana, what did he have to say about this meeting? Nick and CR, the mayor is doubling down on his commitment that the host community agreement will be honored if there is a sale, an agreement that promises things like jobs, local aid and downtown development projects. MGM Resorts International CEO and President Bill Hornbuckle came to Springfield this week to meet with Mayor Dominic Sarno about the rumored sale of the downtown casino. Mayor Sarno said during the meeting he underscored the importance of adhering to the host community agreement. This agreement spells out what the casino promises the city, like jobs, local aid and money for downtown developments. My number one priority is to protect the taxpayers of the city of Springfield and make sure that we receive every dollar in the ironclad host community agreement that we put forth uh, with MGM. That's number one. The casino is the city's biggest single tax contributor. According to Mayor Sarno, there is a stipulation written in the community host agreement that says if there is a sale, the new owner must adhere to that agreement. Rumors of the sale surfaced a few weeks ago after being reported in Bloomberg. The mayor added if there is a sale, ownership needed to go to a well-branded and financially backed organization. There's no way in hell uh, that I would accept any type of honky-tonk, uh, double-A type uh, uh, version here. I reached out to MGM for comment on the meeting and they sent us the following statement. MGM Resorts International remains dedicated to serving the best interest of the city of Springfield. Our president and CEO Bill Hornbuckle had a productive meeting with Mayor Dominic J. Sarno and we continue to focus on the needs of the city, its residents and our team members. State Representative Carlos Gonzalez met with the Mass Gaming Commissioner Wednesday to discourage the sale. We were very um, against any sale of MGM or their name from this building. Uh, we hope that they can stay in the city of Springfield as long as possible. And Gonzalez said he was going to meet with the mayor to offer support to help keep MGM downtown. Working for you, Alana Flood, 22 News.